Howdy folks, Doc here with Last Best Tool. And Top Test has a couple of new gas detectors, uh, the gas leak detectors. I've done videos on uh, some previous versions of these. In fact, um, these two, this small little portable, simple one runs on a couple of, of uh, AAA batteries. This one here, this is the PT520A. Well, now they've got a PT520B+. And one of the big differences here is the ability to zero it. And why that's important is because if you are around a little bit of gas and the thing's going off, then you end up with, uh, you know, it ringing in your ear and no way to kind of stop it. So you want to be able to get, um, the, get it zeroed and then you can continue to work uh, to maybe detect what's going on with uh, different leaks or if you're if it's leaking a little bit and you want to narrow it down That's hard to do when your detectors going off same with these things here I'm actually gonna show you this one while these are firing up. I'll get that one started. It's got about a 30 second timer to uh, Calibrate itself uh, this one very simple very small. These are on sale. I think right now also, but this has a uh, a sensitivity button and the ability to extend the sensor out just a little bit. Okay, these this one's already ready to go. This one is now. You can see there is a difference uh, in the displays. So what I'm going to do is turn on a little bit of a gas source here, um, so you can see how this plays out. Uh, this canister is about empty. Eventually, it'll come on. There we go. So this is going to detect this. Here, there it goes. So it's giving me um, the readout here plus a, a visual indicator saying there's, there's some gas there. This one's now picked it up as well. But let's say, I'm going to move that one out of the way here. Let's say... This is just kind of hanging out at a certain amount here, but I, I'm trying to narrow it down. I can zero it with that quantity of gas available, and then if it continues, then it goes beyond that and goes off again. I could zero, I can zero that. This one's picking it up too. That's what the other beep is. But anyway, I've zeroed it with a lot of gas coming out, which then allows me to continue working. That's huge. Uh, because a lot of times once you're in a gas you know, environment, even if it's a small amount, you end up with all kinds of uh, uh, um, indications and alarms, but you, know, you have to clear it out. Well, you might not be able to clear it out. So where in the pipe is the gas leak or where, which junction or wherever, simply because it's going off full blast. So that zero to me is worth the price of a mission right there, right um, on that one. So let's take a look at this guy. It's ready to go. Real simple design. Um, you can see it's picking it up, giving me level indication. This thing's about dead. Um, and then I can set the sensitivity too. If you look really close, it's the sensitivity low or sensitivity high. Um, and so sometimes that was the way you got around, you know, a gas environment. Let me shrink that for the video here. But anyway, once it's in, I think it might be about, I don't even, yeah, I don't really smell much coming out of this thing anymore. But this does when it's up close. And that is on high sensitivity, so I'll go to low sensitivity. You can see. Anyway, you get the idea. This is actually, uh, you know, these could be lifesavers. They can make life simple um, when you're actually dealing with uh, any kind of gas. I sometimes use these beginning of the year, check the furnace connections. I have a gas dryer, gas water heaters, um, gas stove still. Uh, and I've also got um, uh, some fluids that I use that I always worry about them leaking and these pick it up. In fact, some of these are kind of hilarious. You can you know, pick up bad breath with them. <laughs> That'll set it off. But anyway, there they are. The two new top test, test uh, detectors, the PT520B+. Plus. Um, and this one here, the smaller one, is the PT299. These are uh, more advanced versions of the, um, the PT520A 
and then this one which was the PT210 which I did videos on. So I'm I'm all in with these gas detectors. Keep them handy and use them. And with that, dock out.